hello lovelies welcome back to my channel my name is Steph and my channel name is Steph Beauty Clinic on today's tutorials I'm going to be showing you how you can formulate your body polish ultra body polish and advanced body polish this body polish is going to remove body tag on your skin unwanted black hairs it will help fade away your stretch mark and it also helps reach to home into your skin make you look fresh glow your skin like never before it is called a perfect body polish and this skin this very body polish i'm talking about is going to make you look younger when if you have a dry skin you rest assured that your skin is going to be restored if you have an oily skin it will help polish the oil skin and remove all the dead cells unwanted black hairs grow your natural hairs and glow you at the same time so if today is your first time of coming across my video please do subscribe and hit the bell button so you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video and to all my returning subscribers I owe you one thank you for coming back always being on my video your comments your like I really appreciate and those of you that share my video I say may God bless you all so without saying much further let's go over to my workshop and let me introduce to you all the materials I'm going to be using to formulate this body I've showed us how you can prepare it so I'm going to be mixing my base first before we continue so you must make sure that all is on 85 degree then I'm going to set it outside so while waiting for our base to solidify this is my honey. I have two different types of honey here. So I'm going to be using especially this. This is more organic than this. This is raw and this has been defined a little bit. So today I'm going to be trying this very one. And I have my brown sugar. I always use my brown sugar. And I have my coffee and I have two powerful other powders. And if you want to know the powders, please comment down below because I'm not going to be telling us the powder. And I'll be blending a few minutes and I will leave it. So right now it's time for me to add my glycolic acid and add my preservative. So here is my glycolic acid I'm going to be adding. Two of my half teaspoon of my glycolic acid and uh, for my preservative I'm going to be adding some few drops of my preservative and I'm going to be blended
a few minutes before I start adding it's still hot for a few minutes before I start adding my serum and my oil spot let's leave it for a few minutes to start solidifying After then a few minutes back. our base cream is ready you can see it has been solidified it has been solidified so solidified this is our base cream and if you have not watched the video how to make your organic base cream i will still drop the link on the description box click on the link watch how you can make your own base cream because it's different i use rose water on this uh, very base cream you cannot use rose water for the cream you're using on your body rather you use distilled water that is the two difference the difference between the two when you're making a base cream for your body cream you use a distilled water and when you're making a base cream for bottle scrub or bottle polish you use your rose water i'm going to be setting it aside then i'll go over to mix all my dry ingredients together so in here now i have my 100 ml of my coffee and i have my botanic powders if you want to know the powder that i use Put your comments at the comments box. Then I'm going to be using my brown sugar. I've had a lot of recommendation over this brown sugar, so I'm using this brown sugar, and it's 500 milligram. So I'll mix. If there's any need of me adding more, I will also add more to it. This body polish is one of my best selling body polish and body scrub. It's the best so far. It's effective and it's worth it. So I'll make sure that I mix well all my botanic powders and the sugar before adding my oils so at this point in time i believe that everything is being mixed very well the ingredients are all synced up and i'll be adding all my oils on it at this point in time our powders are ready my dry ingredient is ready i'm going to be adding all my oils in there and i'll also be mixing so keep watching my first ingredient is going to be my honey
I really never want to melt this honey for it not to lose the nutrients so I'm adding it like that so I've added my half cup of honey and I'm going to be adding my lightning glass ring I'm going to be adding three tablespoons of my glycerin. I added my glycerin, three tablespoons. Then I'm going to be adding my rose essential oil. We're going to be adding two full tablespoons. And I'm also going to be adding my skin serum. This is anti-aging. It's going to polish your skin. It's going to lighten your skin also, remove wrinkles. I'm going to be adding a full two tablespoons also. This oil or this serum is so, so powerful. I'm going to be adding My pro glycolic one tablespoon, and I'm also going to be adding my K corner. This prevents green vein stretch mark, fine fine lines, and skin definitions this is one tablespoon and I'll be mixing So at this point, I'll be adding my glycerin to have a proper, a proper mixing. I'll be adding my glycerin to have a proper mixing of this powder because it begins to cake up and difficult. So in here, I have almost three tablespoons of my glycerin, and this is off. We are still going to buy more, so I will also be mixing. So now I'll be adding my magic portion. I'll be adding two tablespoons. And I will also be mixing And I'll be adding my tea tree oil, essential oil. I'll be adding half a teaspoon.
and we are almost done. So at this point, I am through mixing all my powders. I am through mixing all my powders. This is how Nyome it looks like. And I also added my fruit extract. Remember, this is ultra border polish, an advanced border polish that is going to give you that glowness that you ever, ever love to have. Even tone, yes. Remember that this also is going to remove melasma in your skin. Skin maleni will be vanished. You won't even have elevant skin. You are good to go with this border polish. I'm going to be mixing powders in my cream. This is our base cream. Remember how we made this base cream? So I'm going to be adding my powder and I'll be mixing gradually. You can see how yummy this body polish is. So I'm going to be adding my herbal dotto for body polishing and prevention of stretch mark, prevention of dead skin, and it's going to polish you. I am adding two ampoya of it. The main work of this is not only the it's not only the stretch mark, but it's going to polish your skin. It's a body polisher. So I'm going to be adding our vitamin C serum also. I've added my vitamin C powder so I believe that this is finished and we are done our body polish is ready thank you for watching this video if you find this tutorial so helpful and interesting please do give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the bell button as in to be notified whenever I upload a new video not saying goodbye i want to appreciate all of you that's been calling in and purchasing and has been given your reviews also i really really appreciate you guys i say may god replenish you guys immensely you guys are doing a great job and i love you all so to all my returning subscribers thank you i love you to those of you who have joined my membership I love you and I appreciate you all. And if you've not joined, please do also join our membership as you will get all the support that you really need. So until then, see you all on my next video. Bye-bye.